Good morning, Peace Academy. Today is Wednesday, December 7th, 2022, the 84th day of school. I'm Alexis. And I'm Kaden. Let's take it to Olivia for today's weather report. Thanks, guys. Today's high will be 78 degrees. There is a slight chance of rain. Daily winds south, blowing south at 13 miles per hour. Tonight's low will be 57 degrees. Sunset will be at 5.44 p.m. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Now for a moment of silence. We have three birthdays today. Julio Olivas, Adrian Gomez, and Jimena Villar. Happy, Happy birthday! Let's see what's on the menu, menu for today. Beef and bean cheese burrito, muffin string cheese, and yogurt fun lunch carrots, cilantro, lime, um, coleslaw, banana with cinnamon and sugar, salsa packet, low fat or chocolate milk. A um, uh, responsible citizen Look out for be oh being for well being for others and understand we have all parts to play in making the world a better better place. The quote for the month is Accept for responsibility for your actions, be accountable accountable for your results, take ownership for your mistakes. Let's take it to Ed Corner for a funny joke and today's national. I have a joke for you. Let's hear it. What did one hat say to the other? I don't know, what did one hat say to the other? Stay here, I'm going on ahead. <laughs> That's slap on your man. According to history.com, today marks the day that Pearl Harbor was bombed in 1941. On December 7th, 1941, the Japanese military launched a surprise attack on the U.S. Na naval base at Pearl Harbor. The attack killed 2,403 servi service members and wounded 1,178 more and sank or destroyed six U.S. ships. They also destroyed one, 169 U.S. Navy and Army Air Corps planes. Japanese torpedo bombers flew just 50 feet above the water as they fired at the U.S. ships in the harbor. 
while other planes drop bombs. With diplomatic negotiations with Jap Japan breaking down, President Franklin D. Roosevelt and his advisors knew that an imminent imminent Japanese attack was probable, but nothing had been done to increase security at important naval base at Pearl Harbor. The day after Pearl Harbor was bomb bombed, President Roosevelt appeared before a joint session of Congress and declared yesterday, December 7, 1941, a date which will live in infamy, the United States of America was suddenly and deliberately deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. After a brief and forceful speech, he asked co Congress to um, approve a resolution rec recognizing the state of war between the United States and Japan. Three days later, Germany and Italy declared war against the United States, and the U.S. government responded in kind. The American contribution to the, successful, to the successful Allied war efforts spanned four long years and cost more than 400,000 American lives. lives. These photos came from History.com. Back, Back to, to the, the studio. Thank you, Ed Corner. This concludes today's edition of Cyber Tiger News Show. I'm Alexis. And I'm Kaden. <coughs> Weather by Olivia. Ed Corner by Amira and Mia. Mia. Have a great day and tune in tomorrow for another edition of Shopping Tiger News Show. Have a Tiger Big Day!